Okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I don't have a tripod, so we used a couple of books, put it on the kids' picnic table, and I'm sitting in the playroom. I think this is where I will be recording some videos from now on. Well, and you might hear my husband and boys playing out there because they're having fun, so I don't know. They're playing dino trucks. However you play that game. I think it's just made up. But anyway, today's video is January homeschool favorites. And I don't have anything this month to, well, let me back up. Uh, Full-time wife life does this every month. So I will post a link to her channel or to her video for it in the description box. And you can go back there and you will be able to see all the other homeschool moms who have done this. So, um, if you feel, if you want to join in, she has the rules on, on how to join in on her channel. This is my first time, so hopefully it turns out okay. Um, some of my favorites, I don't have anything to show you, so I'm just going to be talking about them. But one thing I'm really enjoying is books. I do a lot of, I like a lot of audible book, audio books, and I got my son the Magic Treehouse books this, a few days ago, and he is only four and a half, but he is loving listening to them. I really think books are good because, you know, and if, especially if you pick good literature, your kids can learn from it, learn different vocabularies. I think it helps with comprehension to listen or, you know, at his age to listen to books or have someone read him books. So either way he's listening. But I think it helps with comprehension and I really like, I really like the audible book, audio books. Um, I get them from audible.com. I have a subscription there. And usually the narrators are pretty good. Now, I don't get them. I, you can preview it first, and if you don't like the narrator, then, or if I don't like the narrator, then I don't get the book, because why would I want to listen to somebody who I don't like read the book? Also, going to the library to pick out books is a lot of fun as well. Um, the next thing is my printer. I know that seems like a silly thing, but I got a laser printer back in August and I have not had to replace the toner. I print everything in black and white and I probably printed about 500 pages at least and I haven't had to replace the toner. So that's been nice and it prints both sides or single sided and it prints fairly quickly, really quickly, whether it's doing both or one side. So. I really like, I'll have to see if I can find the link to the printer to put on, or in the description box. It's a brother, I don't remember exactly the numbers, but it works really well. So I know that was just short, but I wanted to get this out here, and those are my homeschool favorites for January. Please feel free to hit the subscribe button, don't forget to like this video. And I will see you next time for another video.